Hey everybody, it's 615 Tennessee Titans, and welcome to my Money in the Bank 2012 prediction. Alright, so, I am, like before, I am doing this via my voice memos on my iPhone, and then I am, because if I do it the other way where I just do it through the computer, and you can barely hear me, and it's more noisy and stuff and it's more it'll be more clear on here so i have to bootleg it in a way but it'll be a lot better in quality somewhere like that but whatever um so anyway there's five matches uh that are uh, announced that are um gonna take place there's probably gonna be filler matches here and there but half the time they don't ever tell us any matches that go on that are going to happen so whatever we're just gonna go about on what the matches that are announced are taking place. We're going to predict those. So, we're going to talk about the pre-show. Uh, then we're going to talk about the Money in the Bank match. And, and then we're going to talk about the WWE and World Heavyweight Championship match. But first... Um, uh, sorry. Let's talk about the pre-show match. Pre-show match is a tag team match. Kofi Kingston and Archer versus Hunico. And I don't... Can't... I don't, I, to be honest, I really haven't been watching SmackDown, I'm sorry. Whatever his partner is, uh, uh, prediction for this, not gonna be really similarly short, probably Archer and Kofi Kingston are gonna win this one. I don't know if it's for the tag team titles, but, do they still have the tag titles? I don't even know. I, I have not been keeping up with, like, the tag titles and SmackDown, I, the only thing I'd be watching is Raw now, so... Well, I haven't been really keeping up with Mac now. But anyway. Yeah. Prediction. Kofi Kingston and Archer is the win. So whatever. Alright. So. Let's talk about. Let's see. Talk about the World Heavyweight Championship Contract Money in the Bank Ladder match. This one is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7, uh, seven 8 man Money in the Bank Ladder match. For the World Heavyweight Ch Championship contract. Um, the participants in the Money in the Bank match are Damian Sando, Tyson Kidd, Christian, Santino Morella, Tensai, Cody Rhodes, Dolph Ziggler, or Sin er, and Sin Cara. My prediction for this one, it could be either Cody Rhodes or Dolph Ziggler. But, I think they're going to... Have, I think Dolph Ziggler is going to win this one. I think it's his, it's finally his time to have a decent World Heavyweight title run, and he needs the he needs it to start getting him going in, in World Heavyweight main event status. He needs this, so this is a good start for him. Hopefully, they won't mess him up like they did Jack Swagger. Cause we all know what happened when Jack Swagger did that. Oh God. But anyways, enough about that. Uh, now, so I predict Dolph Ziggler wins that. So, the other side, the other, the Raw Money in the Bank, or, is it, I don't know, whatever, it's for the WWE Championship contract. This Money in the Bank match is a four-man Money in the Bank match, which is very odd. It's lower than the six that's usually there, but whatever. The participants for this one are... And be cautious there. These four participants are, they're, they're considering this the former champion Money in the Bank match, but whatever. The participants are The Big Show, Kane, Chris Jericho, and John Cena. You already can see where this is going. It's obvious they, they are trying to make John Cena a World Heavyweight Champion again. You already see this coming. I'm hearing rumors the Rockets. Returning on, he's going to return for the 1,000th episode of Raw. And I'm hearing rumors that maybe Daniel Bryan, whoever wins between Daniel Bryan and Sam Punk, The Rock will go against, and then The Rock will win the title, and then John Cena will cash in Money in the Bank or something like that. But we all we we all know John Cena is going to win Money in the Bank. If he doesn't win Money in the Bank, that would be the most shocking moment of the year because... We we are all expecting him to win. We don't want him to win, but we're expecting him to win. As much as we, John Cena, 
hating fans really do not want him to win. He's going to win. Sorry, it's, it's the truth. There, there, he is the biggest money maker in WWE right now. Even though it's hard for me to say, but they, he is going to win this. I'm sorry, going to win this match. They don't make him win this match. That's gonna be a surprise. I'll be happy about it, but I'll be like, what the fuck. But anyway, enough rambling about that. All right, so now that we got the pre-show and the Money in the Bank matches out of the way, let's talk about the WWE and World Heavyweight Title matches. All right, so first off, let's talk about the World Heavyweight Championship match. The World Heavyweight Champion Sheamus versus Alberto Del Rio. Um, my prediction, I believe uh, Sheamus has had the title since WrestleMania. And I think he's going to keep it still. I don't know when he's going to lose it, but he might He might lose it after this. You may never know. Dolph Ziggler, who was my, predict, who was my prediction to win the Money in the Bank, the SmackDown Money in the Bank ladder match, might end up cashing in Money in the Bank in the same night. So it may happen. I don't know. But anyway, I still think Shane is going to retain the title regardless. But anyway, here's what I think should be the main event. The CM Punk vs. Daniel Bryan WWE Championship match with AJ as the special guest referee. How do I see this as turning out? To be honest, I really have no idea. I'm going to say Daniel Bryan with, because AJ's probably going to get involved with it. She, she, she know definitely she's going to be involved with it. For some reason, I have this gut feeling that Daniel Bryan is going to win. And then, the, and then I've also heard rumors that The Rock would face Daniel Bryan at SummerSlam. Sam, or John Cena would cash in money in the bank at SummerSlam. So, I don't know. But my prediction for this, I think Daniel Bryan might win this match. I wouldn't be surprised if CM Punk wins, but I predict Daniel Bryan to win this match. I know this wasn't really a long prediction video because there's not a there's only five matches I can predict out of this and most of it I really can't give you much detail because I haven't been really keeping up that much with the WWE. Uh, I've only been watching Monday Night Raw and half the time when I'm watching Monday Night Raw I'm playing I'm on the PS3 or doing homework so I've been I'm not really able to keep up with it that much and I want to but at the same time I kind of don't want to anyway because here's the thing I have not watched Smackdown for in a long time it's probably been maybe I think four months since I last watched a Smackdown episode I'm I'm being dead ass that's probably how long it's been since I watched Smackdown or maybe not well not really it's probably been like a month or two Still been a while since I watched SmackDown. But anyway, that is my prediction for Money in the Bank. If you think otherwise, tell me in the comments below. But until then, till my next WWE wrestling video. Till then, see you guys later. Peace.